Alright fellas, I thought I'd make a quick video on this little 20 inch weed eater mower I just bought. Um, bought it off a buddy of mine up the road, I've mentioned him before. He's getting older and he's getting to the point where he don't work on him much, but uh, he did work on this one. Uh, little weed eater 20 inch, the 148cc old school Briggs and uh, paid $30 for this and uh, I bought it just because I wanted uh, wanted one to kind of match my John Deere's I know it sounds kind of silly but uh, and you can't hardly find a John Deere push mower just straight push mower anymore and uh, this looks the part I know uh, the weed eater mowers now uh, I don't know whether they had a lawsuit with John Deere I mean John Deere had a lawsuit with them or if they just threatened them or what but uh, if you look them up online, they're available at Sears, but they've got black wheels now. And I think they told them, you know, you got to quit using their colors or we're going to sue you. Anyway, I'm not 100% sure about that, but I got an idea that's what happened because uh, same with the Yardman mowers that used to be the green ones with the yellow wheels. Anyway, uh, bought two of these and uh, the other one I'm going to sell. Uh, I'll show you it real quick. Let's walk over here. I'll just hell out today too. Uh, we eater 22, which has got the two and one uh, mulcher side discharge option. I don't know if you can see it since the sun's so bright over here. But it needs the uh, rear adjusters tightened up. Other than that, it's a good mower. Runs good. I don't know if it have to prime it again to start it or not. I just had it running. And that one was 20 bucks. Okay, we'll get back here and start this other one for you. I don't know how that turned out since I couldn't see anything for the sun hitting. But uh, I don't know if I need to prime this one or not either. I just had it running. Just got home with these. Like this is idling a little slow. I'll have to look into that. I'm not messing with it right now. But I uh, also wanted to give you an update on the Sabre. Yeah, it, uh, I don't think I'm going to be messing with this anymore. It's, <coughs> it's going to be part two, final episode of this thing. You see all the oil on it. Started it up this morning and uh, ran like a champ. All of a sudden just started smoking like, I mean, before it smoked, it's from, been sitting for two years, but I mean, it was chugging out smoke, you know, like, uh, like crazy and, uh, puking out oil out the, uh, muffler too. So I'd say this is done. I'm not going to mess with it. I'm going to sell it the way it is. The one good thing is, uh, this is the seat pan that was on my old John Deere 68. Took the seat off of it, off of this, and put it on a little 68. Fit perfect, and now I don't have these poking me in the butt when I'm mowing with the little John Deere. So anyway, I wanted to let y'all know about that too. Uh, so I hope y'all have a great Sunday evening, and thanks for watching. Bye.